and uh, what did you see today with this crash? I was sleeping and I, I just heard a very loud, like, it almost sounded like glass breaking. Okay. I, I didn't hear any breaks or anything, I just heard glass breaking. And then it was approximately around 2.30. Okay. And then I couldn't go back to sleep and I, was, I stayed up. I looked outside my window actually because we live right in front of Ives Dairy Road. And I looked outside my window, but I didn't see any, any crash, I didn't see any cars. So I just tried to go back to sleep and I couldn't. So around 12, uh, 2.30, 2.45, I, I, through my windows, through my blinds, I saw lights. So I looked out and then I saw the, um, the rescue and I saw it wasn't my neighbor neighbor, but it was my other neighbor. So then I just, at first I couldn't see anything and I was like, is he okay? And I couldn't see him. So then I came out and I walked up here and then I see the car, this car is like the side of his house, which is crazy, you know, and, and I, right away I went to see if he was okay and he was okay, but I don't know how that happened. It's very strange, um, but he usually sleeps, he says that he stays, sleeps on the couch there at night by that wall and he didn't this, this night for some reason he didn't, so that's good, that is good. Wow. And she crashed in there. I don't know, we still, I guess they're investigating to find out how that happened. Okay, but all right. Everybody's okay, I think she's okay actually also. Okay, great. Tell me a little more about the guy who usually sleeps right there by that wall. Yes, um, he says that he sleeps on, normally at, on the couch, you know, because he doesn't sleep really good, I guess. And he sleeps there till about 1.30. And, but tonight, for some reason, he, he didn't. He was okay and he wanted to sleep in his bed, so, you know, he said he was praying and God is good and he he's, didn't sleep on the couch tonight, so then he heard this loud noise. Wow. Luckily, he wasn't on the couch because the couch is pushed all the way halfway into his living room. Wow. So I guess your neighbor's pretty lucky tonight. He's very lucky. God is great. Thank you, Jesus. He's good. It's good. I hope the driver's okay. No, I don't know what happened, and I'm not sure where exactly she came from. Because, like I said, we didn't hear any breaks. We just heard a very loud, like, breaking of glass, which she broke through his iron glass. I mean, his iron bars. Wow. Right All through right. there. I mean, <laughs> It's mm -hmm. amazing. It's just, we didn't see any cars. You have to literally come here to see this. And there's a big, huge hole in his wall. It's just thank God that nothing serious happened and no one, no fatalities or anything like that. Mm -hmm. Perfect. All right, great. Thank you. Please, now in Spanish, can you also tell me in Spanish, uh, ¿qué pasó esta noche? Estuve dormiendo y oí una bulla alta. Alta, como un ruido, pero no fue como una máquina, como las retrancas. Entonces, oí la, la bulla, pero no, o sea, miré para afuera, pero no vi, no vi nada, ningunos carros, ni nada. Entonces, traté de, de volver a dormir, era como las dos y media, y a las 2.45 no pude dormir. Entonces, por, por la ventana del cuarto, vi las luces, entonces miré afuera, ya estaba la policía y, y el rescue y toda esa gente. Y entonces, no vi nada, entonces caminé para afuera y cuando vine a donde mi... mi my neighbors, oh, okay. los vecinos. Entonces encontré el carro que se metió dentro de la casa. Y el, el hombre siempre, casi siempre duerme en el sofá, dice, hasta la una y media. Pero esta noche no durmió, estaba rezando y no durmió esa noche. Esta noche no durmió ahí en el sofá. Y gracias a Dios, porque el, el, el carro se metió adentro de la casa y el sofá se lo llevaron. Si tuviera en el sofá, no sé qué le hubiera pasado. Gracias a Dios no le pasó nada a nadie. Perfect. Uh, sir, please let me know. Tell us about this experience today uh, with this crash into your house. Well, I was sleeping and all of a sudden I heard the noise, a bang noise, and I thought it was some robot or somebody broke it. Or, and uh, I woke up and I got out and I see my living room was all smashed up. And the lady was out in the car, but I couldn't see her like 100%. And later on, Right away, I, I pressed my panic button, which was ADT, and I called them up, and they they sent the police, and at the same time, I called the police, and then what I saw, the amount of the damage they've done to my house. And uh, normally, I sleep over there, but uh, I, I didn't get up, and I was sleeping in my bedroom. So you actually normally sleep right where the crash happened? No, I wasn't there. Then. But but you normally you normally sleep right there? Yeah, I mean not normally. Like about one o'clock, I get up and I sleep, I don't sleep. 
lots of sleep over there and sleep well. Wow. So I guess it's good this morning that you were able to sleep. I, uh, yeah, I was able to sleep in my, my bedroom is this one over here. So I, I was able to sleep in my bedroom. Otherwise, normally at 1, 1 30, I'm up and I go to sleep over there. Wow. So what is over there, like a bed or a sofa or something? It's like a sofa. Sofa. Sofa bed? Yeah, it's, a, it's an old timer sofa. So oh, like a convertible sofa bed? No. Okay, just a big sofa. Yeah, big sofa. Wow. So a lot of times at that time that the crash happened, you might have been sleeping right there by that wall. Yeah, I would be sleeping by that wall. And I would be dead maybe. Yeah, probably. Wow. How, how do you feel about that, that you're so lucky? Well, I never say she prays for everybody and all the homes. And I think the prayers helps me too. Because mm -hmm. I get up at five o'clock and I pray also mm -hmm. before I go to sleep. I pray and then take a shower, have a cup of tea and then I go to sleep. Wow, so maybe all that praying paid off tonight, huh? Yeah, the prayers to me. Wow. You're a very lucky guy. Thank you. Maybe it's up to God, you know. Mm -hmm. Wow. Maybe maybe buy a lottery ticket? I don't know. We got a good luck today. <laughs> it's Saturday, lottery tonight, right? Yeah, you say that. I, I, I do normally buy like a couple of dollars uh, when I'm coming. I don't know if I bought yesterday or not. I think you should buy a lottery ticket today, man. Okay, I'll try. <laughs> thank you for your tip. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> and thank so, you for your energy. No, no problem at all. And uh, tell us about your house. Uh, how, how's it looking inside? It looks like there might be a lot of damage. Yeah, you can come inside and look at it. Perfect. I'll do that. Thank you very much, sir. Perfect.